if you're going to do a parent dance or two, you can do this one of two ways. You can have a father-daughter dance and also a mother-son dance. Sometimes bride and grooms elect to combine it. So the bride will dance with her dad at the same time that the groom dances with his mother. The sweet spot is about two and a half minutes. If it's longer than that, don't worry about it. And of course, if the song is longer than that, but you want to only dance for two and a half minutes or three minutes or whatever you want to, then the DJ can fade the song at that part. We do provide you with different ideas for that. If you just want a go-to, um, short songs are Louis Armstrong, What a Wonderful World. A longer song, but a good song for either one would be, there's a Hawaiian guy named Is something, I'm not going to try to pronounce his last name, but he has two virgins. He has Somewhere Over the Rainbow. And then he also has a virgin that's mixed with What a Wonderful World. So it's Somewhere Over the Rainbow mixed with What a Wonderful World. So if you pick one or the other, you'll want to let your DJ know which one you pick. Also for Girls and Her Dad, I Loved Her First by Heartland is a common pick. If you are deciding not to dance with your mom or your dad or whoever, make sure to have that conversation with them before the wedding so that your disc jockey isn't put into any type of weird situation. Another idea would be to dance with your parents just during the fast dancing sometime. If you don't want the spotlight on you, then you can have your DJ play a certain song somewhere during the night and not announce it but that's something that you and your dad or whoever can dance to. You'll want to let the DJ know to make sure that you're in the room and that you're ready before you play that song. Now, the easiest thing to do would be to have your mom or dad pick the song. Then you don't need to worry about it, and they can worry about it. That's it.